Well, here we have a 1986 Jeep Cherokee 2.5 liter uh, before first. And so uh, we really plan to do is replace this uh, thermostat. And first we're gonna start by the housing. Well, as you can see the main problem, it is the, the housing broke. And uh, let's see. So we need to replace it. So, uh, so this one is uh, kind of simple. Well, no big thing. So, with the little screwdriver, we're gonna undo the brackets here. Okay, that one's undo. I'm done. And then this one too. So, and then uh, with a 13 millimeter, we're we want to lose uh, the bolts and uh, as you notice I already didn't do it and uh, this one too uh, this one is also undo so and then underneath it has something else also to do it so also 13 millimeters but uh, it'll be really easy to get it out as soon as you get everything else out so much we're gonna start doing what we can uh, making sure that uh, we're being aware that antifreezer is there so whenever you do it it's gonna be a little bit the, of the antifreeze so let me retreat or taking this bolt out so like I said this house was broken so it's gonna be easy for me to pull it out. So, well, we make sure that we don't lose any parts. And so, we kind of put them on separate area where we can identify. So, I already had this taken out. So, for you, there's the thermostat. We also, this is a good thermostat. It had probably like a Two, three months or eh, so three months and uh i mean three months and it was pretty good shape it was just uh, the house and broke and so this is what i was telling you we need to kind of take it that uh that i already do it with my 13 millimeter so i take this out mm. Not so hard. I just put it there. Remove these. Ah. Then I gotta get my the rest of stuff. So when I need these to finish the job and a new housing, so which we have a new housing here. Which we already painted out, or I was. You don't have to. So if, and then if you do, just make sure it's a heating paint. So this is uh, it was silver, so I painted it great. Doesn't really matter if you do or not. I just uh, like to keep it and stuff kind of neat. But yeah, this here. So. All we gotta do is just put everything back the way it was, so don't forget to use uh, some scraping here. Uh, use scraper. Put it up. The mess that was there. I already done it, so sorry. <laughs> I decided to start recording this afterwards, but yeah, I just gotta make sure all the dirt comes out. Yeah. And I uh, pretty much uh, tried to clean them. It will do a better presentation to your car and also uh, <laughs> you don't have any issues later on where you have there calcium and smoke. And then if you have a leak on the gaskets here on the top, just uh, tie this a little bit. I mean, this, this, and just all the way around. So, uh, hold on. Start putting it back together the way it was, so just remember how it was, so.
Thank you for watching.